Good morning. Sunday morning. Happy Sunday. Welcome to Z Education and welcome to another episode of You Laugh, You Lose. If you are new to this channel and new to this series, the game is simple. If you laugh at anything, you lose and you have to do a punishment. What is today's punishment? You guys, in honor of book release week, the book is out in two days. There is no punishment. I'm going to be nice to you guys. This one's on me because you don't have to do a punishment. No punishment today. A big, big week. Thank you to the thousands of you that have pre-ordered a copy of my upcoming book. I hope many of you watching that have not pre-ordered also choose to do so. And I'm very excited to see your guys' responses later on in the week after you guys have a chance to read it. So thank you, thank you, thank you. More on that later this week. But no punishment today. So if you are ready to play today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you laugh, you lose, go. How men do shopping. How women do shopping. This is my wife at Costco, and this is me at Costco. If I have to go in there, I know I'm, I'm getting straight there. Go to the protein bars, come back. That's it. I'm done. This is why I don't go in to Costco with her anymore. When 1.30 a.m. hits and they turn on the lights in the nightclub. <laughs> uh, you know, that's they, they keep the lights down for a reason. So, haven't been to a nightclub in a long, long time, but that's, just, that's what happens. Children are the world's most valuable resource and it's best hope for the future. John F. Kennedy. <laughs> There's a kid with a plunger on his face. Where is this? Walmart? Looks like Walmart uh, with a K. That's right. Uh, why do all the old timers say Walmart? I don't know. But children, they're our future. Fight Club. 72,746 people are talking about this. And 72,746 people are now kicked out of Fight Club. What are you? Only two rules, man. Shut up. Police stopped me and said, Papers? I said, scissors, I win, and I left. I think he wants a rematch. Bro has been chasing me for 45 minutes. You can try it. Probably going to jail, but you got the win. You got the W. That's all that matters. Somewhere, someone is showering with a mask on. I just know it. Uh, even in 2024, it just, it is what it is, man. I, I've, I haven't fully accepted it yet, but I just, I just know that there's a, a certain percentage of people that will continue to do this. That's, that's where we're at. In every relationship, there is one person who stacks the dishwasher like a Scandinavian architect and one who stacks it like a raccoon on crystal meth. <laughs> and which one are you? I'm definitely the raccoon. I always just, I put the bowls in there. Like it, it, you don't have to stack them nice. And if, especially if you put the bowls in and they're like stacked slanted right on the bottom shelf there, the water isn't going to get up into that every time. You got to have some space. You need it sitting on top. So that's just my theory. That's my, and I don't, I'm, I'm not doing it right though. <laughs> if anyone gets a message from me about canned meats, don't open it. It's spam. Ba-dum. Ting. That's dumb. Uh, also spam, Austin, Minnesota. You're welcome. It's a Minnesota product. Very proud. Putting a fresh battery in my food timer. Don't show that to your insurance companies. If this is how you time your food, you, you might have a hard time getting some homeowner's insurance there or the premium might go up. When you're eating at Olive Garden and someone says compliments to the chef. This is like um, Starbucks, a lot of those coffee shops. It's, it's microwave food. Is it delicious? Of course. Is it good for you? No. Is it hard to make? Probably not. Me. Ah, the house is finally clean. Here's a bucket of toys to dump out. <laughs> Toddlers, man, they're little tornadoes. I, our daughter, she loves the blocks, like the big Legos, you know what I'm talking about? And all of a sudden, randomly, you just hear, uh, she likes to build towers. But every once in a while, she just likes to dump the bag out. And just, pfft, all the blocks are everywhere. One thing nobody ever talks about being an adult is how much time you debate yourself on keeping a cardboard box because it's like a really, really good box. I honestly, I don't know if I've ever had that problem. We have way too many boxes. My problem is, is getting rid of them. I just, I literally just burned a bunch of them because they wouldn't fit in the garbage can. We've been set, just keep stacking up and stacking up, just burn them. Ruining your new year's resolution since 1962. Mm. 
You know, speaking of Minnesota pride, most Dairy Queens per capita, Minnesota. That's right. Every tiny little town that has, you know, a thousand people, 600 people, they all have a, or they all have a, a Dairy Queen. All of them. It's, it's just a part of, it's a part of Minnesota. Kids will call your name 100 times just so you can watch them do something like this. <laughs> this reminds me of the Stewie clip. Family guy, anyone? Mom, mom. Can we play that? Mama, mama, mama. What? Hi. <laughs> just so you know, you can order a 40 pound bag of Lucky Charms marshmallows on Amazon. <laughs> Wait, what? Like, hold on, just, just the marshmallows? Like no, 40 pounds. And everyone knows that when you eat Lucky Charms, you eat, at least this is how I used to eat them. I haven't eaten Lucky Charms in a long time. You eat the, the crap cereal first and save the marshmallows till the end. It's like a little dessert. Everyone does that, you know? If you're not doing that, you're doing it wrong. When you see a funny meme, but you don't like the person who shared it. <laughs> I'm not even kidding you. I do this on, on Twitter. I'm not kidding you. I like, ugh. This guy again. <laughs> I don't know much about birds, but I can easily identify the husband in this picture. <laughs> Husbands, I know you're laughing at that right now. Ladies, stop rolling your eyes. Stop, stop it. Can you identify the husband? I know you can. Eh? When I was young, I wanted to play the guitar really badly. After years of hard work, practice, and determination, I can play the guitar really badly. Um... Smoke on the water doesn't count. It does not count as a guitar riff, as a song that you can play. Every person on the history of persons that has ever touched a guitar can play that song. Always make sure the contractors you hire for home improvements are licensed. A true professional would never put a white faceplate on a page. <laughs> Stop it. I This cannot be real. It's, oh my. I... I hope that's a Photoshop because yeah, beige, beige shot on, on white. Oh no, that's a mistake. English teacher. Anyone want to guess who wrote Tom Sawyer? Student. Rush? English teacher. <laughs> Today's Tom Sawyer, mean, mean, bad. Do, 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 do. You know, his mind is not for it. Dude, we're jamming today. We are jamming. Rush, great, great band. An air mattress is great when you want to sleep on the floor, but not right away. <laughs> I slept on an air mattress for like nine months. I'm not even kidding you. I was trying to save money. Uh, I had a studio apartment. It was, yeah. And this was my life like every night. <laughs> but mattresses are expensive, man. It's like five, 600 bucks. Vacations are cool. But have you ever stayed home in your pajamas and not spoken to anyone for a week? I think that counts as a vacation, especially if you're not uh, answering emails, texting anyone. I, I think that does count. Can we, can we all agree that is a vacation? Hollywood solution to fight online piracy. Make movies so bad no one wants to watch them even for free. I got to say, I'm a big movie buff, love movies. It has been really bad the last few years. We've had some good ones come out, Top Gun 2, right? Movies. Especially the ones that go on streaming sites like Netflix. Garbage. There's been very few that are actually good movies. Time to break out the snow socks. Anyone else? Anyone do this? We, it wasn't Wonder Bread. But like we had the, you know, the Walmart bags. Time, put them around your socks. Put your, and you know, then put your foot in the boot. I lifted up my shirt to check out my abs and a Dorito fell out. So there's that. <laughs> your, your abs or your gut. Don't lie. Don't lie. Unless put the Doritos down. They're delicious. I know. I know. The purple ones, I don't even know. Are they zesty or something? The purple Doritos, so good. But you can't do that. You can't do that if you want to be, you know, have abs. Me. Yeah, let's play the game. I won't get too competitive. Also me. <laughs> you know, there is a line of comp like fun competitiveness in, you know, what's that train game? All, all aboard. No, the train game. You know what I'm talking about? Monopoly, whatever. But if you're flipping the board, if you're getting mad, you're ruining friendships, and you're breaking out kneecaps, taking kneecaps to the knees, taking a bat to the knee, that, then we have crossed the line. Mom said, alcohol is your enemy. 
Jesus said, love your enemy. Case closed. Cheers. Blasphemy. Blasphemy. It's not, it's not what he meant. It's not what Jesus meant. When your name is Craig, it, it can do this if you want. Um, whatever, man. Afraid to die alone? Become a bus driver. Uh, yeah, that's a, that's a dark one. That's a real, real dark joke there, right? You know. No, next. How to tell you're an adult? You gain 30 pounds overnight. You'd rather sleep than go out. Everything hurts. Comfort comes before style. You have a favorite spatula. Everything feels like a chore. College students look like 12-year-olds. You're always annoyed as half. <laughs> Cats against humanity. Uh, I do have a favorite spatula. I'm not even kidding. I have not gained weight. Um, rather sleep than go out 100%, 10 out of 10 times. Everything's starting to hurt. That's it. You know, I work out and like it takes me a, like an extra day to recover now. I think I'm an adult. I think it's, I think I'm officially an adult. Ahoy! Boat captains with short tow ropes, please pull closer to the dock. Mm, yeah. They didn't have to be jerks about it, you know? <laughs> Somewhere, someone did this for a stupid TikTok. I gotta see it. I hope this wasn't for real. Like, you really, you didn't think this was gonna happen? <laughs> Rapper Lil Nas X has performed the art of trolling Christian outrage to market his music. Now do Islam. Yeah. Is, uh, I, I would like to see him do that, truly. I want to see, I, I want to see the, the blowback, the, the, the response when he does that. Randy Moss doing an interview on national TV from his fishing boat. Oh, I love it. Mm. Yeah. Guy loves the fish. Congrats on the Hall of Fame. All-time great Viking. Best wide receiver of all time. Everyone knows that. Uh, yeah. just He's in retirement mode, man. He's out fishing, doing a national interview. He's on his boat. I love it. Saw a mail truck in the cemetery today. I guess they have started delivering the ballots. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. That's funny. And also uh, not funny at the same time. <laughs> I don't always carry all the groceries on one arm. But when I do, my keys are in the wrong pocket. <clears throat> I feel like... You got to go through a checklist. Make sure you shut the car off. Make sure you have a way to shut the door. And always, always, always make sure you have your keys in your hand before you put the bags on your arm. Because this happens every time. The Cool Kid 1996 Starter Pack. Ooh, dude, this was the Cool Kid. No fear, bruh. Uh, Jenko, is that the jeans? The freaking haircut. Offspring. Offspring, dude, you were cool if you listen to Offspring. The yo-yo, the wallet, the shoes and the freaking CD player. And I don't see it on here, but you were really cool if you had the uh, the CD folder. We've talked about this many times on the show, but if you had the CD folder, yeah, you were really cool. Girls with Photoshop. OMG, I'm gonna make my butt bigger. Boys with Photoshop. That's, <laughs> I, I think this is, yeah, I would, I love Photoshop just for this reason. Is that a Lannister shield? Why you got it the cat in the Lannister shield? It's always tough being the fat kid in school. It must be extra tough being the only fat kid in your entire country. I don't know. He's got some family members that are looking a little chunky too. While the rest of his country starves, but... You do you, man. He's just dragging on darts all day, drinking booze, firing missiles, and getting fatter. So I got a notification from our security camera that someone was at the front door. <laughs> buzz him in. <laughs> so stupid. I can't believe I just laughed at that. <laughs> peaches, 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 peaches. Awesome movie. Super Mario Brothers. I loved it. A lot of nostalgia in there. Fun storyline. If you haven't seen it yet, highly recommend. My boyfriend got his side girl pregnant, but we both love each other. Should I stay? Yes, they'll need a clown for the kids' birthday parties. <laughs> Perfect answer. Perfect answer. No, you shouldn't stay. Are you kidding me? How much does a roof cost? Nothing. It's on the house. <laughs> That's so good. It's so funny. Oh, let's do it. That's like a couple bad jokes today. Shame I can't afford PS5. Get a job. I live in Lebanon, idiot. Get a Lebanese job. 
Yeah, get a job. Jeez. Want something? Go get it. Who is this? Wrong answers only. Liz Cheney. A uh, picture from last week, actually. Map of every recorded battle in history. It's missing the dot of me in the bathroom right now. Grow up. Grow the hell up. In a sometimes crazy world, never forget that this is astronaut Leland D. Melvin's official NASA portrait. Look at that. Look at that. You love to see it. Some positivity there, right? Showing an ID to votes. Showing a vaccine passport just to leave your house. Ooh. <laughs> you know what? That's worth bringing up here. We're in election season, whether you know people like it or not. But uh, these issues do matter. And this is one of them that is kind of funny. It's like, wait a minute. Hold on a sec. Whoa, 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 whoa. You support it in one case, but not the other. Okay, all right. Glad I learned about parallelograms instead of how to do taxes. It's really coming handy this parallelogram season. <laughs> I always love those memes. You know, and there's always, you, know, you should know about a lot of stuff. It's good for critical thinking and brain development. Yeah, well, I, the taxes are important. How do you write stuff off? How do you write, how do you create a business to write things off? That's what we should be taught every, every class, every, every grade. You may not like it, but this is what it looks like to be a millionaire in 2024. Point of view, you have a cup to match every outfit. What the? A cup to match outfits. Now that is next level absurd. And that, we are talking... Lots of money right there. I hate to say it, but it is true. My brother got his mirror stolen, so he put his work phone to replace it. <laughs> Whatever works, man. Wait, hold on a sec. Mirror stolen? Someone stole your mirror? What the? Why would someone steal a mirror? Like, and just the glass portion to it. They didn't even, like, rip off the, the whole mirror. They just took the glass. Okay, just hear me out. That is spot on. And hey, what's uh, what is up with this girl and why is she so popular? Like she has become a hero. They're painting her as a hero. And I understand what happened to her is really messed up. 100%. Totally agree with that. But she still helped kill someone. There might be other solutions than killing someone. I don't know. And that's just my that's just my initial thought. A lot of you might be in the comments right now. As well, here's the here's the details, and this is why you're wrong, Tyler. Maybe I don't know, but it's it's weird. She's everywhere. I see her everywhere. Scientist, let's name this spider long legs for its long legs. Scientist too. Hmm, not kinky enough. <laughs> I you know, it is weird to think about. Like who and why did they add daddy long leg? Why did they add daddy to that? I couldn't just name it long legs. Like, do me a favor. Tell your boyfriend he yo ex now. <laughs> Dude, what a what a freaking DM dropping. Dude, that is called swag. That's like that's confidence to like up here. <laughs> that's amazing. Don't be this guy. Go hands free now. It's the law starting tomorrow. He's following the law a day early. Congrats, man. Good job. We made it to Friday, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Long week. I get it. I get it. It's Sunday. You're about to start another week. But hey, positive thing. You get The book comes out this week. You get to read the book. So <laughs> hopefully it gets it through this week. I don't know about the next week. You know, so when you realize he's right in the argument, Okay, but why are you yelling? <laughs> what does Bill Burr say? Bill, what's his joke? When you win, just take a knee. Take, stop, don't, don't punch back. Let her swing. Just dodge it, take a knee. You won. That's it. There's no need to keep going. Just take a knee. Be quiet. Let her get it out. And that's it. You won. You won. Enjoy it. Embrace it. But don't, let's take a knee. All time great. Bill Burr, love him. My wife hates being embarrassed, so we surprised her at the airport. Welcome home from prison, Mom. <laughs> this is a this is an idea to put in your your idea bank for the future. This is funny. It's now officially the season of I'll pay you back when I get my tax refund. Aren't uh, refunds supposed to be a lot less, like last year? The um, 
the child tax credit or whatever it was, the, the deductible, standard dedu deductible. Can't remember. So hopefully you get a refund. I used to think coffee was a grown-up drink. Then I thought alcohol was a grown-up drink. Now I have finally achieved full enlightenment to understand that it is water that is the grown-up drink. Learned that a long time ago. I've been grown-up for a long time, guys. I've been preaching this forever. Oh, you just graduated? That's nice. I will have the mocha frappuccino. <laughs> you know, I, I, I think I say this every episode now. Know what you're getting when you're going into debt with college. Yes, it's not what you think it is. Parents used to tell my brother and I that we had another brother who turned into a mushroom from not taking a bath. Even added him to the family albums. <laughs> That's one way to get your kids to do what you want. This one, this is next level deception. <laughs> Parents, what are your thoughts on this? Is this CPS worthy? You should call CPS on this. <laughs> one hour after my wife saw a raccoon in our driveway. Mm. I don't know why. I don't know why they do this. My wife did this for a, a, a stray cat, which turned out to be the neighbor's cat. This is probably like four or five years ago now. But stop doing this. Please don't say firecracker. It's very offensive. The term is fire Caucasian. <laughs> I've been saying this for years too, man. Firecrackers. It's offended me for a long time. I'm glad there's memes going around about it. Found the guy from those math problems. <laughs> if if Jerry had 500 carrots. Glad we found him. Real life. Don't lock unless I married you, birthed you, or ordered food from you. Mr. Beast, who is about to give them 20 cars. <laughs> Look, you don't want to win a car. And I mean that. You don't want to win a car because you still have to pay taxes on that with money you probably don't have. So if you win a, you know, let's just say $20,000 car, $30,000 car, you got to pay, I think it's considered income, so 30% on that value of the car, so six grand. Or whatever the, the car... I don't even know. You have to pay a lot of taxes on it. Mr. Beast has talked about that, actually. Fill out one of these and God will bless you with money. Job application. <laughs> hey, there you go. There's how you make money. Who would have guessed? Found the roadkill deer and stood it up to slow down traffic. That probably works better than like a fake cop car or a fake radar thing. It's not a bad idea, honestly. They laughed at my crayon drawings. I laughed at their chalk outlines. Jeez. Dude, that was dark. <laughs> Jeez. Get that kid into a home. Um, he's got some that's some that's a future dom right there. When you eat whatever you want over the holidays and finally check your weights. Have you guys gotten to this stage yet? Have you finally in January gotten to this stage? Did you do it right after New Year's? Or did you give yourself a couple extra weeks? So people really out here putting hot sauce in the fridge. The back of the bottle literally says refrigerate after opening. And y'all still put it in the cabinet. Y'all don't follow directions. And that's why y'all keep getting pregnant. <laughs> I didn't see that one coming, but that's, that's true. The hot sauce goes in the fridge. It says on the bottle. That must be the carpool lane. That's a really good barrier with very few uh, cracks in it. Very few leaks. Yeah, it is a carpool in. In, where is that, Bangladesh? Jeez. If rhymes were accurate, roses are red, violets are violet. Roses are red, violets are violet, Neil deGrasse Tyson should sometimes stay quiet. I would 100% agree with this. This guy ha is, he is unable to have fun. Have you seen his, uh, his Santa Claus tweets? You got this, to a, a poem. Like, dude, relax. Lighten up, bro. Have have a cocktail. I, I generally don't condone drinking, but I think you need one, dude. Like, come on, old-fashioned, great drink. I'll, I'll buy it for you. How'd you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose. But again, there's no punishment today. In honor of this week being book release week. I know you guys have heard me talk about this now for like six, seven months. So it is finally here. I'm very excited for you guys to read it. And I hope all of you decide to uh, to support it and go pre-order or order on the day that it comes out. Thank you all to have supported it so far. I really, really hope you enjoy it. And I am looking forward to seeing what you have to say. So let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed. 
This is education. Kleptocracy. Uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Idiots. <laughs>